Vancouver Island and the Gulf Islands are home to a number of native plant species that have been in this area for centuries, though some of them are now in peril. Parks Canada, with help from student volunteers, is working to preserve many of these threatened plants as part of an extensive conservation program. A news reporter Eric Thompson and videographer Wells Gates visited, visited one of the islets where the restoration work is now underway. Anniversary Islet is a tiny gem in the Pacific. It's part of the Gulf Islands National Park Reserve. It's off limits to the public unless you have a permit. This sensitive ecosystem is home to several native plant species, including camas and Indian paintbrush. There's like a bino white camas. So this island here um, is an example of one of the Gary Oak ecosystems or associated ecosystems that we're trying to restore. As you can see, there's quite a, a beautiful wildflower display. Those are all native wildflowers. What do you like about doing this kind of work out here? Well, it's uh, definitely not a bad job traveling out to the Gulf Islands to do restoration work. It's fulfilling work and you see the progress while you're going along and it's a great experience just working in environmental restoration. This is one of about a dozen tiny islets in this region that are reflective of an ecosystem that has been in place for several centuries but is now in peril. What we're doing today is we're removing an invasive species, an invasive plant species, and it's called anthriscus or burr chervil. So this is it right here, and you can see it has little white flowers on it. And we're hoping to remove as much of it as possible before it turns to seed. I think what's special about this is there's not many Gary Oak ecosystems in this state left in the area, and it's nice to come to an area that is almost a pristine Gary Oak habitat um, and do invasive species removal or restoration and know that it will have an impact if you're persistent. As you can see, we've got beautiful wildflower meadows here and um, what, what people can do is that they're, they're living within the same ecosystem or habitat as what we've got here. So all these native plants that we see here can be grown at home. You can learn more about nurturing native plant habitats at your home online at goert.ca. And for more information about the Gulf Islands National Park Reserve, go to parkscanada.ca. On Anniversary Islet, Eric Thompson, A News.